Comedians opening cards, no coffee, and we're here with Sherrod Smalls, just running to him on the street. On the street, hanging out, and look, he's, in my neighborhood. And he's advertising himself. White man came up to me. <laughs> I no can't jump. Cards. <laughs> 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 I thought it was some induction. Okay, so we got a whole bunch of cards on the ground, and uh... All right, let me get my weed out the way. Just All right. Let's see what we got. Well, yeah, let me see that E.T. E.T. is great. E.T. is e. nice. Can't go wrong with that. Young Drew Barrymore. Oh, my God, yeah. He was still doing that blow back then? He was eight years old doing blow? I can open it, right? Yeah, that's the idea. You okay. open one and then just sign one at the end. Talk about whatever you, you know, why do you pick E.T.? Because you... You know, everybody knows E.T., extraterrestrial, and who don't feel like an outsider? Mm. I mean, I think they were still talking to exactly the black people in this country when E.T. came out. It was so weird, that magical thing when they took off on the bikes, though. Yeah. Definitely. Like, that was kind of weird. I mean, he had powers of uh, alien. I'm sure he could do other I things. I guess. And then now, though, because he dressed in he dressed in women's clothes, I don't know if that would be like, you can't show it maybe anymore because of the freaking time oh, right. period. He, yes. And then Dennis Rodman was next. It was first E.T. <laughs> in, in a dress. And they took the guns out. In E.T., the, the, in the original movie, the dudes had guns, the That's right. agents, and they turned them into flashlights or something. That's right. Yeah, which That's is whack. That's right. Yeah, yeah. You know what they didn't have enough in E.T.? What? Anal probing. <laughs> that finger? You know that finger with the light on it? Oh, yeah. That finger with the light on it going somewhere. And you know where it is. Oh, you know. <laughs> <laughs> here we are. They're gaining. What is this? Mm. Okay, here we go. I got a shutter thing. Oh, I don't know, you know. Spielberg. Oh, it's that crazy light. That light. Well, I don't remember this scene. Yeah, it almost looks like Close Encounters. Yes. Shh. But E.T. was the was the bomb. Oh, without a doubt. Yes. He was, you know, he was looking for a 90-day fiancé. E.T. couldn't stay here. He needed that uh, K-1 visa. <laughs> <laughs> he was the first one looking for that K-1. <laughs> Sterilizing the house. Huh? That's right. This is like a meth house. It's like a meth lab. First time we saw a meth lab. Thank you, Steven Spielberg. Yeah, they, they, it was all, it was like a Christo uh, work. Now here's E.T. right here. Now that's a, you know, he was the first black lead in a movie. <laughs> he was the Wait, first, just because he has a long neck doesn't mean. This was the first, I'm your captain now. <laughs> I enjoyed that one. Oh my God. How much money did this movie made? Oh, I can't imagine. That was an early one for him. What is Alien, uh, this Alien, uh, what's the boy's name? Oh boy, he looks... Terrible Hell. there. Yeah, what pictures? Why does he look like that? That's what he, he looks like. Die? Death. Yeah, he was doing white face. <laughs> that's yeah, he like Eddie Murphy on a bus. Uh, <laughs> SNL. <laughs> the last white person, last black person, got off the bus. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, what's the boy's it's name again in the movie? Elliot. Elliot. Yeah, Elliot. yeah, yeah, yeah. And that was the, the, the that was like one of those early tie-ins with the Reese's Pieces or pieces. That's right. Like it was such an bar. early that's right thing, and it was all over the place. First time a commercial got in the movie. I think so. It was you uh, know Spielberg. Yeah, everything. He out Judas all, didn't he? Oh, and that's a sticker. Oh yes. Yeah, oh look, he's it. picking his nose or something. I think he was going blowing this one. There you go. Both he's got both. Yeah, he could do a lot. That's ET in Vegas. Wow, that's a weird. With a shirt That's off. That's a weird Looking image. like a pimp. I don't remember. <laughs> I don't know. They're making up this. Is this an extended uh, version this of a movie is, that we all know? This is the R or X version. I like it. It's like the Quentin Tarantino <laughs> a, version of E.T. As a pimp. Yeah, these are oh. different pictures. Now, was he... That was where he's dressed up. Isn't that where he's in the in the when closet the as closet, a girl? Yes. He's wearing the clothes as a girl. He which was, you, Yes. He's the first trans uh, alien. Dressing. Yeah. I think yeah. Billy Crystal did it first on Soap. Remember Soap? The TV yes, show? 100%. Billy was first, but then. Yeah, that's right. People forget about that. They need a more black people on E.T., by the way. E.T. was the only brother in the movie. <laughs> Elliot, what's Elliot doing now? It was the suburbs. <laughs> in, the, the in, the, in the 80 yeah. or the, I mean, you know. Happens. I think it was Levittown with E.T. <laughs> <laughs> no blacks Levittown. allowed in Levittown. Wow. Uh, look at the history of that. Yeah, exactly. Okay, E.T., no shirt on, look like Putin. Look again, he's like, he's real thin, but he's almost... But he's almost got, yeah, he got you know, chest on him. Yeah. He's like he trying to get some he, earth pussy. He's built. Oh, he's trying to get some earth pussy. Uh huh. Okay. Oh, now here's the bikes. Here's the bike scene we all loved before they went oh. up in the air, but they was running away from the agents on the bikes. They're running. He's gonna crash into that dude's head. This had a little like a uh, Goonies in it. It was a little Goonies-y. Who else came yeah. out first, Goonies or E.T.? E. 
I don't. Uh, yeah, probably E.T. Okay. But okay. I, you know, but BMX. I mean, they brought that into the movie because that was a, that was That's super it. popular. Up, uh, you know, that was a big up. thing at the time. Skateboarding you, and the BMX stuff. E.T. also needed one of the cast members to die. They needed a River Phoenix. Uh, to really yeah, yeah, to yeah, get yeah, the yeah, 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 yeah. Effect of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, they had just the sadness of, of E.T. not getting home. They didn't need a death or something. Maybe is E.T. watching another ship leave on TV like this. Hot. Oh, oh he's so sad. That takes me back. Yeah, he's <laughs> watching TV of us. Before I was flying off. on bikes with white kids, I actually <laughs> had a like... spaceship. <laughs> oh, how, how do, boy, you really miss home when uh, that's the that's the video. E.T. was a big box bus in uh, 80, what, it, it, oh, 82? Oh, 82, I think, yeah, 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 82, probably right. And it was this last one in Times Square. This one he was going to Times Square. So you're Square. a New Yorker. I'm a New Yorker. I'm oh, from Brooklyn, but yeah. we went to Times Square to watch the movie. Right. It was packed. There's no more girls in there. Me and my cousin Tony, Tony Rock, another comic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, yeah, it was a big movie. It's a big movie. Right. Even people in the hood were really kid about ET. They yeah. That's all. Yeah, yeah. Plus, we're all just a bunch of immigrants. Right, right, right. Uh, yeah, ET yeah. was one of us. Exactly. Yeah, that's true. You know, I didn't even, I didn't even think about that. ET but... was a little Haitian, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he yeah, had yeah, a little yeah. Haitian in him. Yeah, yeah. yeah. First of all, black democracy. If you just sign one for me, and then you know, uh, you can take the others home or whatever. Yes, you I want to sign the pale face. Um... Did this one have gum or no? Yes, it had. Gum. Yeah, yeah. I, I put it Four to the side people the have eaten gum. That, how, how old is this gum? From whatever year this is. So if this is from 82, the gum's from 82. And you can still chew it? Well, no one's been happy with their decision. Who ate the and, gum? Um, Norman was the first one. To chew the gum. And yeah. so then I tell everyone. But Norman was the second person. It's to, so hard, this gum. Look at it. And then I tell everyone that Norman ate it. And then some people eat it. And then are instantly disappointed with their decision. And you're like... Why are you doing that? It's breaking up. Look, it's crumbling a little, but and it wasn't good back then. It wasn't good back then. <laughs> so it's not. It didn't. It didn't. It's not wine. I'm gonna side the one with uh, Elliot and oh, the, the white dark. face. He's the ghoul. Yes, but he's going out, boy. He's yeah. He like, oh, got that he's a ghoul. Oh, this is great. I mean, I would watch this movie again, like on a big screen. Yeah, I haven't seen it in so long. I don't know. Again, though, I'm disappointed the guns wouldn't be there. Now, do you think we're gonna get an ET two? ET two is a long time to make it. Well, you know, the thing now is the, um, the Mattel movies because of the Barbie. Right. There's oh, like yeah. 40. They have 42 movies. In, they're working on an Uno movie. <laughs> the card? Yes. Jesus Christ. Yes. They have nobody Spanish in it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not one Mexican. Hey, it's not Dora. <laughs> Uh, well, oh my god well I, you know go see live comedy because it's the best yeah Sherrod Small go to my uh, uh, Instagram I'll too. put all that shit when, I, when I when I do it up so look at it all right. randomly E.T. I didn't go signed it with a sick Elliot and E.T. pointing to the hospital awesome thanks so much Sherrod thank you man it's the thank best Opening cards, no, no coffee. coffee. Oh. Comedians opening cards, no coffee. Comedians opening cards, no coffee. All right, that's cool. I'll just edit it. Okay. Comedians opening cards, no coffee. Comedians opening cards, no coffee. And what's your band? The Blue Snappers. The Blue Snappers, and we're in Maine, Portland, for the Art Fest. Thank you. You guys. It's comedians opening cards, no coffee, and I'm here with Aaron Berg. Hey, how are you? We're, there's a building back there. I'm very excited to do this. I'm already looking at the cards that you have, thinking about my choice, and it's not going to be an easy choice, I'm going to tell you that. Yeah. There's some good ones. There's Here's my thought-making process. I'm thinking, what would I really like, but then what would my daughter really like, or what my, would my wife really like? So I... You could do one and take, you can take some home if you want. I would you know. go for... She... I would like either Three's Company... Yeah. Or... The A team. Oh yeah, no one's opened the A team yet. I think I might open the A team. And no real like a like a open micer guy did Freeze Company. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, up in uh, Vermont. Up in uh, Vermont. And Greece looks great. No one's opened to Greece. Home Alone looks great. No one's opened Home Alone. This is crazy. Yeah, yeah. There's good ones. Yeah. There's good ones. Needle it's fun. I wouldn't go for Hyborian Gates. No. Dark Crystal. No. Supergirl. Meh. You're right. Desert Storm might be cool if it's just a bunch of dead people in the alf all right i'm going 18. what's his name uh fuck uh will Sylvance was like there's no black ones so i went out and got freaking uh Rob marley Rob. i'm like you know there's black ones hunger uh, games well and then 18 has uh what's his name hobbit kojak used to arrest him all right ready we're just gonna film something real fast it'll take one minute one minute one minute 
All right, these are the 18 cards. Here we go. These are the cards. Gosh, you can't stay here right now. I'm oh, sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. Still in the building, you can't see it. Okay, I'm sorry, sir. All right, there is gum. <laughs> There is gum in this packet. Four people have eaten it. But it's very old. Right. I'm not going to eat the gum. Right. right. Wise move. Packet. No one's been pleased with the decision. First one I have is... Yeah! <laughs> Thank you, Jeremy. Thank oh, you. Oh, sure. That's Sorry. Murdoch. Then I have... Oh, why did you pick A-Team? Because I... A-Team was a great show to watch. Right. I, I loved up. it. I loved it. And the thing about these cards are they're not well printed. They're, they're so blurry. bad. They're just blurry pictures someone took of a TV. Is it Tops or is it not? While they were watching the show. Or is it like Donruss? Because Tops was good back in the day. And then Don, Donruss, oh, it's got Bazooka gum. Donruss made some good cards. Tops, Tops. yeah. Donruss makes better cards. But the ones like uh, the Too Dallas ones are terrible. Howling Mad. These are literally just pictures they've taken off the... Howling Mad gets depressed when he hears that his mother died. I never knew her. And now I never will. This is terrible. Just terrible. So I think what? what this is, is either it's from an oh. episode. Right. Maybe the episode was called A New Assignment. The Face Man jokes with Amy about the A-Team's new... Oh, the Face Man was a funny guy. Jew? But it's spelled J-O-O. <laughs> Maybe it's Job. <laughs> the, oh, the my God. If B.A. were a beer drinker instead of a milk lover... We'd all be safe and sound at home. Don't let him hear you say that, Amy Richards. Yeah, so it might be from... That's a cool uh, B.J. Barakas sticker, though. B.A. Barakas. B.A. star, you know. And then on the B. back is a puzzle. So if Part you collect the... all the stickers, I'm sure it makes a puzzle. Exactly. For everybody. Oh, that's Another fun. really horrible photo. <laughs> Blurry car. Nice car crash, though. These are not... These are not good cars. It's a low quality. These would have had... Uh, no, they're probably worth nothing. <laughs> Well, sealed up, you know, or as a whole set. It's amazing how easy it was to be a hot chick in the 80s. <laughs> really overbite. Just, <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a 10 in Hollywood. <laughs> Harvey Weinstein fucked me. There's a whole crew. <laughs> That's how I got on the show. Every That's episode animal. was the same, though, with that, like, they had to make some Ooh, weird... Oh, then slow-mo. That's it. That's the Awesome. Of the oh, Aaron Burke, thank you so much. Thanks and so much. You're all over the place. Uh, if you just sign one for me, then if you want to keep the others, you can have them and stuff. I don't want to keep them. Yeah, I know. Some people do, some people don't. Got the Comedy Store shirt. Yeah. The you touring around in things? No, I'm trying to stay in the city. Right. Build up Street Famous NYC. Yeah, the pot, the, 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 I mean, you got to watch the show. You got to watch so the it's, show. So it's more of a... Street Famous NYC, patreon.com slash Street Famous NYC. And it's hilarious. It's very funny. He's so quick on his feet, and you're so good just with random strangers on the thing to just yeah. bust their balls. I almost got punched in the face by a heroin addict. But I it doesn't surprise me. I could sense it when he stood up, and I was like, oh, I might get punched in the face. But you were just ready to take I've it. I've never seen you not crush when I've seen you. I uh, sometimes don't crush, but yeah. it's rare. But every freaking time. Oh, did you want to pick something yeah, for your let me daughter? Grab in some, the... Let me grab something for my kid. Let me see. You're dropping the fake gum everywhere. I know, I know. But uh, do I want to keep it? Yeah. <laughs> no. Well, I can't... Grease Company. Yeah, that's a great one. I don't want to take all yours, but I did well, want... And what was the other one I liked? Greece. Greece. Perfect. Awesome. Thank, Thank you so you. much, man. Have Thank a great you. sets and stuff tonight. I'm sure you will. Do you want to keep them? Yeah, definitely. Awesome, man. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. Will you sign one and give it to me? Yeah, for sure. Or write something or whatever? Good, That'd be good. good. Wait, uh, give me the Jordan Peterson one. All right. Or whatever. Whichever one. All right. Rockstar status. Sorry yeah, to keep you waiting. No, you're good, man. Wednesday night, I'm at the stand. It's comedians opening cards, no coffee. And I ran into... Josh, hi, and uh, you just did your set. No, I, I was I was not on the show. Oh, uh, <laughs> no, I'm just friends with a bunch of people on the show through the comedy community. So. Oh, kick butt! Did you come to see like a specific person, or just a bunch of people? Uh, a bunch of people because the the show tonight was uh, shout out to the Wahoo mic. It's a it's a Waffle House themed open mic in Brooklyn, and then they uh, produce a show monthly as well. And so this was their first time at the stand. So oh, uh, fun. Just, just coming out to support some great. It's a great open mic. Oh, kick butt. Oh, open mics are... If it's a good open mic, that's sometimes rare. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, so we got all these cards. Um, you yeah, can... This is so cool. So what? where are these cards from? Well, you'll see. I mean, okay. they're just old packs of different stuff. 
I mean, they're from... <laughs> Alf, nice. Yep. Alf is very popular. A lot of I, people have picked so Alf. So I just pick a, any of these? You pick whatever you want, then you'll open them, and then, you know, if you'll tell me why you picked that pack, maybe related to whatever, and then if you sign one at the end, that would be cool, and then you can yes. keep the other stuff. If you so okay, desire. so these are all, because I didn't know if these were open yet or not. None of these have been opened, but people, I have some that are multiples. I just put one at a time. Yeah, you know? yeah. Like Alf, I bought a whole case. Yeah. So, <laughs> you know, and... That one seems to be right in the like right zone of you know majority. These are so cool. I, yeah, and then there's more here too. Oh man, yeah. this is I. I'm just. It's a little overwhelming, probably. No, yeah, it is. Uh, a little it's, probably overwhelming. I don't even know how to go about. Uh, I, this one's a contender. This Denny's Hobbit one because I feel okay. like Denny's is adjacent to a. Uh, oh, the Waffle, Waffle House. House. Oh, that's hilarious. And then I love uh, <laughs> Tolkien. So uh, right. Yeah, let's do, let's do this one. Let's do this. Perfect. Let's do, how, do I, how do I get this bad boy? It's, it, it's probably behind. Yeah, yeah there we exactly. Go. Okay, uh, so this is. Uh, I'll, I'll hold up to the camera. Ooh. <laughs> uh, so, um, what do you think that was like a freebie if you bought something just to say yeah, like a McDonald's probably, or something? Probably like a Denny's cross promotion with The Hobbit, which right. does not seem like a good cross promotion. <laughs> like, that seems like uh, the worst world's worst marketer. It's, but, yeah, those two things don't seem to go together, maybe. Yeah. Like, Hobbits, uh, maybe it's because Hobbits have a second breakfast. This is my, like, Hobbit <laughs> knowledge coming out. Where I'm like, oh, yeah, they eat a lot. And Denny's, you want to spend but, a lot of money. But do, does, do, does Denny's really, I mean, I guess they do have the, like, Grand Slam. Grand Slam and all those and all that, so yeah. maybe they do want to promote eating. Yeah, a lot. Eating I guess a lot, they do. Yeah. Eating, eating double so Maybe the Hobbit makes sense. Uh, so, yeah. Okay. In a roundabout way. Okay. Let's see what we got here. I oh, got beautiful cards. Beautiful cards. Uh, I'll hold up to the, the camera. Yeah. Uh, it's another. Oh, that's like. Yeah. It's another it? like. Um, Collect all twelve, including these two limited yeah. edition. Hey, I hate how so, every single card says in theaters December fourteenth. Yeah. Like so they really wanted you to well, know. Every once in a while, like this kind of card is talking about the cards themselves. It's like a meta card. Every <laughs> yeah, once in a funny. while, cards put this in, and you're like, well, I don't want this. This is a bullshit yeah. ad on a card. Like, yeah. what is that? What's like, the point I of that? paid for, like, I, I should get right. a third of my money right. back for right. the third of the card that isn't here. Are there only three cards? Oh, because oh, it's... Well, hold on, hold on. Now I understand. This is a coupon free beverage with purchase of an entree at Denny's. When does that expire? Uh, Did it expire, or...? It, 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 it offer ends one fourteen thirteen, so I think we're a bit uh, late. Um, you know, maybe you can make that one the thirteen into a twenty three, and then just go and in. Then you're you good. Know? Uh, you know, there'll be like uh, there are more more Hobbit movies coming out too. So it's, right. it's you just yeah. bring in an after in a new like, Hobbit movie because maybe they'll have another thing and they won't look at the. See, thing. but now I'm even more confused because <laughs> I would assume that you would get this at a Denny's. Right. And it doesn't seem like that's the case because why would Denny's give you a coupon to the Denny's you're at right in that moment? You know, like now, oh, I'm like yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, did you get this at the theater and then that's, and then they're like, go to Denny's I, after seeing The Hobbit? That's a good it's call. Still open. I bet you're right. I bet you got that. At I the, love they, that. Like, handed that out at the theater. Yes, that's a good call. I love that we're call. creating like Denny's ex Hobbit canon right now. We're like, this is we're, we're inside the heads of the market. Well, they team. probably. You know, Denny's probably paid for the cards. Yeah, And yeah. then it's a cross promotion, and then so Denny's advertises for the Hobbit. The Hobbit distributes the cards at their at their theaters. It all works out for everyone. You know. Yeah. Um, okay. And then we've got uh, Ballin and Killy. Do you know uh, who those people are? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Um, the Hobbit is that, got, uh, who, that? Who wrote? Is that Tolkien? Yeah. Yeah. So it's like before Lord of the Rings. It's like the setup to. The, That's the, like a trilogy it's by a that trilogy same person. Prequel, yeah. yeah, yeah. I never read that um, stuff or watched that stuff, but yeah, I know it's popular. It's popular. The movies aren't as good. People are talking. I'm gonna get. This is gonna blow for for hate. Where people are like, oh fuck this guy. He doesn't know what he's talking about. But like the book was small, and like the original uh, right, right, Lord right. of the Rings movies. What they were praised for is having like a good page to film minute ratio. Oh. Um, but like The Hobbit is such a thin book. Right. And there's only, you know, so uh, it's it's not, it doesn't really suit like doing a full trilogy on it, in my opinion. Okay, yeah, yeah, so yeah. So they're really stretching the movies. And I've not, sold the book and I've sold like. Do you a, sell books? I sell all kinds of stuff. I mean, hence this, all this yeah, crap. Yeah, this is awesome. I sell shit on eBay. And I've sold a cool, like, old poster from when maybe something came out or of that Tolkien thing. That did really well. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure. Uh, and then they have descriptions on the back. 
I really hate how branded this card is. Like, it says the date, but then also on every single card on the bottom, this is brought to you by Denny's. Right. You should not post this video without going to Denny's Corner and be like, you pay me for this video, otherwise I'm blurring it. I'm We're going to bleep it out and bleep every yeah, time. Yeah, 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 yeah. We bleep it and we put the Waffle House logo here. Right, yeah, exactly. Like, exactly. Pay, pay, I'll pay. just call, call it David's, because since that's my yeah. name is David, then it will be. Oh, yeah, yeah, there you go. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, and then it has some descriptions uh, that we can read, but I don't know if it's going to be very what, entertaining. Yeah, whatever you want to do is fine. Uh, no. I'll do it. Balin, a dwarf lord of noble descent, is one of the oldest members of the company of dwarves. Wise and gentle by nature, he has been forced to live a life fraught with war related to Thorin. Balin is one of his closest advisors, but deep in his heart, his, this wisest and most loyal of dwarves harbors troubling doubts about the wisdom of the quest of, for the Lonely Mountain. Boy, I just gotta see the movie now. I just, I just, I just don't think I could live with myself. If I didn't immediately go see this movie. I gotta see it. I need um, to know more about him. Yeah, uh, <laughs> man. They thought so too. <laughs> they totally agree. <laughs> they are like having, having a ball. Um, were they the people who are commit, who are inside? Yeah, yeah. These are other fellow goers of the Wahoo Open Mic and oh, wow. local comics. Oh, um, awesome. I'm trying to see if there's anything else on the packaging. Uh, no, just more. Uh, and no gum or anything like that either. This comes so, out after probably they, they stopped yeah. giving out the gum. Probably an unexpected journey in the names, characters, items, events, and places there are trademarks of the Saul Zaints Company. Uh, wow. Z A E N T Z. I don't know who that guy is, but he's probably really rich. Saul uh, Yeah, I don't know. Under license to New Line Production. You know, it's really interesting. This is just meeting the nerd again. Yeah. Um, like, it's crazy who buys the licenses to certain things and like how they get licensed out. Where I went to Indiana University for college, okay, and we had a professor there who uh, was like an executive producer on all the Batman movies because I think it was him or his father, I don't remember which, bought the rights to like the, the, the filming, making Batman films. Right. Back right. in like the 50s. Right, right, right. Before right. it was really like a thing. Right, right, right. And then like now every time someone wants to make a film, they have to license it from him. And so he gets an executive producer credit. Right. And like some say in the movie. Right. Um, and that's just forever. And like the way that he got the rights is that his uh, father-in-law was a rich doctor. Right, right, so, right, right, right. Uh, sure. It was, just an, yeah. like it was just an investment. It was just an investment. Yeah, yeah, But yeah. I'm like... So when like, uh, who is it, Lucas or whatever, with Star Wars, you yeah. know, when that came out, so Kenner made those toys. Really? Well, Kenner made the little figures, the yeah, three and a half yeah. figures. Kenner had been around for a long time, but they made junk toys. <laughs> they, were, they were like, because other companies wouldn't take the thing because licensing for a movie tie-in thing was that was brand new yeah. like he created that whole thing Mego was the big toy company they made like these like nine inch tall action figures back in the day they were like the man they passed on it then Star Wars made Kenner huge yeah. it made them so much money Mego which was way bigger then bought the license to every goddamn oh. franchise in the world <laughs> sure. and went out of business. Oh, that's funny. It's hilarious. I mean, they yeah. had like Dukes of Hazard. They had like love... Because everyone's lining up to buy the Dukes of Hazard. Right. They <laughs> make love boat little fucking figures. Like, it's insane. And of that course, who, right. who bought that shit? Yeah, that's that's such like a classic, like, I'm going to overreach so right. hard. Right, because they it was like they had to go yeah. for it. And, like, and, I don't know what's cool, so I'm just going to assume that everything is going to be cool. Exactly, now exactly, exactly. <laughs> Exactly. Cool. Well, it's this so is nutty. so nutty. Um, man, and they also have the best cards. Yeah, so, so collect all 12, including these two limited edition cards, and they're like, sucks for you that you didn't get these. Right, yeah. You just got these two other shitty cards. So I wonder if you were to have gotten one of one of these two, then would this card not be here? The third card would have been one of those. One of those, I maybe. Bet. I'm also surprised that there's only 12 cards. Like, that does not seem like well, many because cards. because it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a tie. Yeah, it's You're giving a free well, I'm, I'm holding Denny's to a high standard here. I'm well, like, that's they, your problem. You should, it yeah. should, I mean, it's too bad it's not Waffle House. It's too bad it really is. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe there's, the cards are so dark, but if you'd yeah. sign one, yeah, probably absolutely. that, whatever. Right. I don't know if Do you, you want, want to use it. blue or black? It, or, I don't know. It doesn't really matter. All right. Yeah. I will, I will, I'm going to do two things on this card. First, I'm going to change this one to a two. The coupon, that makes sense. Right there. And I, I completely, it just looks like a smudge. Yeah. It's the, the, the Sharpie's not And then the other thing point. I'm going to do is I'm going to sign it. Uh, 
in the hopes that you find uh, peace and love at Denny's. <laughs> awesome, Josh. Thank you so much. Yeah. And, and do you have like an Instagram or whatever your stuff is or anything? Uh, it doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah. You can find me on Instagram, Josh Levy 007. Um, and, uh, James I Bond fan? Uh, James Bond fan. Awesome. Um, and uh, yeah, I produce roast shows all around New York. So. Have you ever met the freaking uh, the guy who is on, now he's on um, the Conan O'Brien uh, uh, podcast? There, I can't remember his name, but he is the biggest James Bond fan. <laughs> really? And, yeah, like um, he knows every guy. I wish I could think of his name. He's a, He was like an improv guy. He used to do a, uh, it doesn't matter, yeah. but whatever. But he like, because he's, he's adjacent to the comedy world, yeah. but has been in it. Boy, if you're a James Bond fan, like he would just let you know. I don't know, whatever. Yeah, no, that's I think he did a thing where they like he used squibs and stuff. Just, he did? Yes, like on a <laughs> like they squibbed him up for a thing to recreate oh, something. Yeah, it was like oh, it's wacky. Okay, I'm gonna turn this off. But thank you so much. Uh, awesome. Good. Thank Thanks, you so Dave. Much.